how do I get it all done? And you're probably, you know, one thing I want you to notice is I've done videos. I have hundreds of videos online. And right now you see the sun shining into my face. <laughs> my husband and my son are actually going to get something to eat and they want me to come along. And I'm kind of like, no problem. I'm not even hungry. <laughs> but you know what? I want you to know that we all have differences with our lifestyles. I have a spouse. I have children. Uh, I used to have a full-time career. I have teenage daughters that love their mom and I love being a mom to them. So they wanna spend a lot of time with me. So you have to find the best time in the day for you. You also have to understand how to manage your energy. And I do that through vitamins and supplements and juicing and healthy eating through exercise. But you know what, specifically, when you look at all of the nine different things that I listen, that's just nine. I have a book that's coming out that has 20 ways to grow active and multiple income streams with your active and passive income streams. But what happens if you look at your calendar for the year and you segment the information out? And so instead of pulling it down from the sky and just having the field of dreams mentality of I'll build it and they'll come, which they're not gonna come. That's not how online works. What would happen if instead you looked at your calendar and said, this part of the year, I want to establish this. This part of the year, I want to establish this. So I want to show you how to get it done. And so many people, this is where, you know, people would look at me and say, how do you get it all done? Well, it's because I manage my day. I have a vision. I manage my calendar and I am a laser focused on what I'm supposed to be doing. And I don't deviate from it. I get laser focused. I get the work done before I move on to the next thing. I meet a lot of people that want to have multiple businesses and do a whole lot of things, but their first business isn't profitable. They haven't learned lessons. They aren't following people. They don't even have a direction. They don't even have a coach. Don't fall into that trap. Get some help so that you can go further, faster. And the other thing is, everything about your online journey is just not going to be perfect. I can go back to my first course that I ever launched and oh my goodness you know now looking back it's sort of an embarrassment but I like the founder of LinkedIn Lynn and he says if you're not embarrassed by the first version of your product then you probably launched too late get it out there so what if the sun's on one part of your body and not the other do the best you can with what you have and if like me you have a family and they're loud in the house or they're doing what families do and what kids do don't holler at them Find a better place. Find a place where you let them know that they're first, they matter, and you can come outside and have the sunshine in your face. <laughs> so let's get on to the video because I want to show you how to get to your quickest $1,000 and I want to show you how you can do it with your time. Now how to make your first $1,000 online? You can sell a product, retail arbitrage, create an information product, continuity programs, teleclass, webinar, training programs, outsourcing, ebooks, consulting. It all sounds great, but the big thing is you have to start. You, you have to start and you have to finish. So you have to pick one and say, okay, I'm going to go with this one and I'm going to make it work. Because what happens is with part-time entrepreneurs, we pick one, we get some results with that. And we pick another one, we get some results with that. What would happen if you picked one and waited till you hit your first $10,000? What would happen if you picked one and just focused on your first $100,000? Think you would make it happen? I know that you would. So it's really pick one and do the work. And I focus a lot on quarters, Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4. You'll hear me say, well, I need to get this done by Q1. I need to get this done by Q3. And if you took out your calendar and said, okay, Q1, I am going to, by Q2, I'm going to have my first book done. And by Q3, I'm going to create an audio book and the print copy. And by Q4, I'm going to host an online teleclass, a webinar. Now you have now outlined your entire year. You don't have, you know, some people say, I'm going to publish 50 courses. Well, have you published five, even one? That's that realistic goal. We want to stretch. But once you have a win with publishing your book in Q2 and marketing it, and then Q3, you have the print copy and the audio version. In Q4, you have your courses and your teleclasses and your webinar. That's a year and you built up authority. And that really is the quickest way to get your first 1K. 
going out and doing your retail arbitrage, finding out everything you can about Amazon FBA, going out and setting up the consulting services and marketing yourself as a consultant and being very helpful online and being very helpful with you know, people that have questions and seeking out some universities or seeking out people that want to get into your industry. I'm in an industry now that people, I mean, it's just, they want in so bad that they couldn't, you know, well, people there, my, my job understood why I left, but there are people that want in. You got to, you got to take out your calendar and you got to pick one and you have to do the work. And then you have to think about your accountability, mentor, coach, mastermind group. Someone has to hold you accountable for what you're doing. And the challenge is with goals is you want to tell everyone, but then there's that gratification of telling everyone you feel good and then you don't get it done. So you want to work towards your goal. I'll put a little bit of things out there like my daughter and I have to get a book done or, you know, these are my goals for writing some books. But I'll tell you what, I know that my mentor, my coaches, my mastermind, I know who's holding me accountable. Even my coaching clients in my inner circle are holding me accountable. So make sure that you have an accountability partner and, and, and not just one that, you know, well, I'm kind of sort of in business. You kind of sort of in business. We just want to work with this together. No, 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 no. Get with people that are truly able to help you move your goals further along. And when Q1 or Q2 comes, they're cheering you on and saying, okay, what can I do to help? Accountability is extremely important. Because you're only going to hold yourself accountable for goals that others know about. Tell someone what you're up to, but don't broadcast it to the whole world. And again, that's a personal preference. But when we go back again, I want to encourage you to get out your calendar. Back it out from where you have your Q1, your Q2. And then we're thinking six weeks. If you know you have a six week time frame to get that book done, what are you going to get accomplished in six weeks or eight weeks or 12 weeks? keep educating ourselves and um, just doing the work. I want to thank you for your time. And it's really important to me that you achieve results. So make sure that you're tweeting at me, come visit me on YouTube. And um, you can see me over at montinaportis.com. And what you'll see is an example of a squeeze page. And with that squeeze page, it's just another great way to build your opt-in list when people are saying, you know, you have some information, I want to learn more. Again, that's what I use mine for. Instead of it going to a website, it actually goes to a squeeze page. Yay! Now you know how to get it all done. You have all of the information that you need to get to your quickest $1,000 online. I mean, I gave it to you. And this is my gift to you. I'm freely giving you this knowledge and information because I want to see you succeed. But most of all, I'm getting ready to open the doors of the Full-Time Success Academy. This is a place where part-time entrepreneurs can come to convert their passion into profits and make their first $1,000 online. You have a dream, you have information, but how do you dive deeper in understanding who your idol clients are? How do you dive a little bit deeper in understanding how to do keyword research and identifying your profitable niche? How do you dig deeper if you're not quite sure yet what you're passionate about? Where do you start? What do you do? Well, when the doors to the academy open, there are 20 different modules set up for you from video marketing to self-publishing secrets, strategies, and tips, all the way up to money maps and how do you write your business plan. It's there for you. You see, I was a part-time entrepreneur. I worked for nearly 10 years with a Fortune 500 company. I was an information security analyst and I've been a corporate trainer and I've been business continuity and emergency preparedness. And you know what? I really enjoyed what I was doing. I was happy in my career, but I walked away because I replaced my income and I found a way to serve others online in my own business. And I want to help you do that as well. So you have all of the information to get to your quickest 1K. But again, when the doors to the academy open, I'd love to have you come in. I'm inviting you in to get more information, 20 modules, videos, audios, worksheets completely set up. And of course, there's a money back guarantee. I want to teach you how to convert your passion into profits. I want to teach you how to grow your part-time fortune. I want to teach you how to grow multiple streams. The question is, will you let me? I'll see you behind the doors in the Full-Time Success Academy. Again, thank you so much for letting me serve you and forward these videos to someone that you know so that they too can get to their first 1K.